Hey, what's up, Rafers? I'm Rafer Matt, and I don't have time to make this video, but I'm going to anyway. Stay tuned. Hey, what's up, Reefers? I'm Reefer Matt. I'm not an influencer or a content creator. I'm just a real reefer like you. I make these videos to share my reefing journey, so feel free to share yours with me, Reefer Matt. And as you can see, the uh, 75 gallon needs a little attention too. I've just been so uh, busy lately. Uh, I don't have time to clean it every day, but usually every other day or so. Uh, I'll clean the glass. It's probably been actually about three days uh, looking at this now. Uh, but the snails do a pretty good job, but uh, it just needs a little extra attention. So I just make myself do it and uh, you know that way it don't build up too much. Yeah, this Apex system is really a time saver for me. Uh, I didn't get it just because it's uh, you know tech and expensive and stuff. I got it because it saves me a lot of time. Uh, I have multiple tanks and I got the tridents for a couple tanks and it does the testing for me. And I also have a dose, so I got all my dosing taken care of with it. And uh, that's just how I handle being busy and still trying to get my maintenance uh, taken care of and the monitoring. Uh, and then with that and water changes, uh, that's just how I keep up on things. All right, well, after I clean the glass, you can see it looks a little bit better. You can actually see the coral now. And I just make myself do it. I mean, these guys aren't going to take care of themselves. The snails help a little bit, like I said, but I still got to do the water changes and, and uh, check on everything. So, you know, that's just the responsibility of being a pet owner. That's what these guys are as pets, even the corals. So uh, they're not going to do it themselves. So I just got to carve out some time wherever I can and I'll uh, take care of it. But, uh, I do have, like I said, other things that help me uh, with my time, automatic testing, and uh, that, that really is the key, I think, to uh, my success when I'm real busy like this, because I have a lot of tanks, and it's hard to keep up on all of them. And a lot of us probably seen a tank like this. This is just how it gets when you don't get time, uh, but there's no coral in here. I just clean the glass when I can, it just comes back. Uh, about four or five days later, so I just do what I can. These guys are supposed to help me out a little bit, but you just do what you can. You, you make time where you can uh, and not try to stress yourself out keeping up on it. But as long as everybody's healthy and stuff, there's not a huge deal if you have algae like this. And uh, I'll get it taken care of. Yo, Reefer Matt, how about you get to work over here? Hello? Can you hear me? Yeah, you. I know you can hear me. Get in here and clean this mess up. It's not going to take care of itself, you know. And here's another time saver for me. This is where I mix my salt water up. I fill this up with RODI water. And I'll show you. I have, basically, it's a older skimmer pump and it aerates the water and I just mix my salt water in here and then I adjust the alkalinity and everything too but uh, this just sits here mixes and then when I'm ready to do my water change it's ready to go I, let, I do it at least a day or two in advance and that way I'm not struggling you know at the last minute to try to get that water change done this has already been mixed up and uh, then I use this one right here I just drain it in there it's got a little pump there inside pumps it out I just pump it in the toilet to get rid of it and uh, you know it's a pretty quick and easy water change most of the time because I can just wheel these things around so that's a time saver too for me uh, I know that not everybody can do that you, you uh, might have the buckets and I do have a tank that I use buckets too so it's just something you gotta you know you gotta do when you're taking care of your pets well I hope you don't mind but uh, I am beat I am tired I've been working a lot of extra hours so I think it's time I relax, uh, don't you? I'm sure a lot of you have been working a lot of hours too, so we just gotta find the time where we can uh, and do what we gotta do. I uh, know that the tanks can't always be the first priority, but just remember they're your pets and uh, they deserve your attention too. 
I want to give a shout out to Rev at uh, Reef the Reef and the staff. Uh, thanks for the hat and uh, the shirt. Uh, I really recommend going to Reef to Reef. Uh, it's an awesome community. Uh, it's free to join. Uh, there are some paid options, but it's free to join if you want. And uh, you know, you get some help if you want or share your uh, reefing journey. And it's a really cool place to be. And I'm on there too if you want to talk to me. So uh, you know, just look for uh, Reef to Reef at reeftoreef.com and uh, you know, check it out if you haven't uh, done that already. So the next video will be a review on uh, this aquarium monitor by Cactily. Uh, these folks reached out to me and asked me if I'd like to review their product. Uh, this is an aquarium monitor. It uh, monitors, I believe, seven different parameters. So I'm gonna put it on a couple of the tanks and check it out and I'll compare it to some of the test kits that I have and see how it does. Uh, see if it's worth you know, your money or anything. I'll give you an honest review on it. And uh, you know, I've, I've read some reviews and it's kind of like uh, middle of the road. So uh, you know, I'll check it out and see what happens. And I'm getting geared up for the uh, Sterling Heights frag swap next month. That's on April 21st. That'll be in Sterling Heights, Michigan. And I'll put a link in the description uh, so you could check out uh, the address and everything if you're in the Michigan area and you want to go. So, uh, you know, if there's any, if you've seen any of my past videos and you want to get some of my coral, that'll be a place to go. I promise that uh, it'll be cheaper than you think. So I just like to get out and see uh, all the reefers and uh, meet up with the, some friends and stuff. So uh, be looking for that. And uh, I'll definitely make a video while I'm there too. Uh, and there's also some other things I've been uh, doing lately. Uh, I've gotten into 3D printing and I'm making a lot of cool stuff. I'm really excited about it. I even uh, started designing a few things. Uh, so I, I think it'll be, uh, you know, another uh, side hobby of my hobby, if you will, uh, doing 3D printing. So I'm really excited about it. And another thing I'll be doing soon, uh, probably around May or so, is I'll be uh, doing a giveaway. And uh, that'll be just for, you know, you guys that watch the channel won't have any requirements at all. Nobody has to, you know, subscribe or anything. Uh, but be looking for that. Uh, I'll make an official announcement and uh, I'll do a video. It'll probably just be, uh, you know, you commenting on a video or something. And I'll just do a random, uh, you know, a random uh, generator or whatever of the comments. And uh, I'll get you something nice. Uh, but be looking for that around May or so. Well, that'll do it for this one. I'm Reefer Matt. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video and happy reefing.